Hello everyone, I have a video that is going to be showing you how to reach five stars in your island. Now, um, if I'm going to be honest, I don't think that you really need to follow this. I mean, I think that you can just play the game and then just progress and that's just how you do it. I mean, it wasn't that hard for me to hit five stars. I just like placed a bunch, I just started decorating and just catch bugs and I just played the game really and then I got five stars. It wasn't that hard to do. But if you really want to know the specifics of what it takes to get five stars, if you're like, if you have, if you've been having trouble maybe getting five stars, then this video is going to be helping you out because I'm going to be um, sharing with you the specifics of what you need. So I basically just have a list and if you can follow this exactly, if you are looking to get five stars really quick, I've got the list here and we'll just go over this and yeah. So the first thing that you need for your five stars is to have 10 villagers move into your town. Yeah, so just have your plot filled up and get 10 villagers to move to your town. That's very self-explanatory. And the next thing you need to do is reach the credits to get KK Slider to start visiting. So KK Slider is right here and that's perfect. So you just have to follow the story. I think Tom Nook even guides you to how to get KK Slider. So actually KK Slider is actually one of the biggest movements toward five stars I would say that's like the big event that needs to happen and then the next thing that you need is to have both island shops able sisters and nook's cranny they have to be upgraded so nook's cranny only goes through one um upgrade and then able sisters definitely goes through two renovations also so you have to have both able sisters and nook's cranny done and the next thing you need to do is seven bridges. So place seven bridges, that's all you need. And then the next one is pretty like the same as the last one. It's you have to place six inclines. So seven bridges and six inclines. And then you have to place 50 to 60 DIY furniture, which that seems like a lot. I don't remember putting all that stuff, but I mean, I, I must have put it, but it didn't feel that like that much so and then you need to place 20 to 25 pieces of furniture bought with nook miles so you have to buy them do the nook miles yeah, definitely a lot of things that you'll probably want so i don't think that's going to be too hard to do you have to place 40 to 50 pieces of furniture purchased with bells this is probably the easiest thing that you can do go to nook's cranny and literally every day you'll see something new and you'll just buy it so, and this is just the most fun thing ever, just going to Nook's Cranny and seeing what they have every day. And let's just go ahead and check what's in here today. You need 50 through 200 pieces of fencing. So, yeah, 50 pieces, that's just the minimum, you know. I love this piano. I actually really want it. I don't know how much it is. $53,000. I... And that's not that much. I really could go get some money. And then you need to have 110 grown trees, which you might think it's like so much, but actually I believe that when you start the game, you already have a bunch of trees. So, I mean, and once you start planting trees, I mean, I'm pretty sure you can reach 110. And you have to have 10 grown bamboo thickets, which I'm not sure what that is, but I'm pretty sure it's just 10 grown bamboos. That's really easy to do. And then the last thing that you need to get five stars is have 250 or more fully bloomed flowers. So yeah, plant some flowers. I remember planting like every flower that I got. So these were just some of the specific requirements for having a five star island. I hope that you found it helpful if you're looking for the specific um, requirements. But my honest, my tip is, is that only follow this if 
you haven't gotten five stars in a long time like a lot of weeks because when i just played the game i got five stars pretty quickly i mean it didn't take that much i think what really got me five stars was when i started to really decorate my island very like a lot so i just placed a bunch of furniture and i started decorating i feel like that's just when it just happened and that makes sense because a lot of this is just placing diy furniture and then placing furniture that you bought with bells so definitely just start decorating just enjoy the game and play and yeah so hopefully you guys found this video helpful if you did just give it a like and subscribe and i will be posting more soon i'll see you guys in another one goodbye Thank you.